Presents USA, the greatest entertainers in America, as requested by you, the service men and women of the United States Armed Forces throughout the world. Command performance presented this week and every week till it's over, over there. <laughs> gang, this is Ken Carpenter starting our run with Bombay's Loaded with Stars and Songs in answer to your letters to Command Performance, Armed Forces Radio, Los Angeles, USA. We've lined up a real free-for-all in the Command Performance Music Hall this p.m. with three great singers in the center of the ring. I'm speaking of Dinah Shore, Jenny Sims, and Frank Sinatra. And coming down the international runway with those Memphis blues, Miss Command Performance herself, Dinah Shore. <laughs> This is Dinah. With Jenny Sims and Frank Sinatra on duty tonight, we hope to hit you with a broadside of six full-size tunes. And what's more, we're going to do the corniest melodrama of the century. Therefore, consequently, and because of, we're pressed for time. So I'll just take a half a second to send love to the woodchoppers of the Women's Timber Corps. Also, the British Nighthawks, including Docky, Ricky, Horsey, Blondie, Rats, and Doggleface. And fellas, here's another member of our three-way tonsil marathon tonight singing Kiss Me Again, that really swell guy, Frank Sinatra. Sweet summer breeze Whispering trees Stars shining softly above Roses and blooms Wafted perfume Sleepy birds dreaming of love In your arms Far from alarms Daylight shall come But in vain Tenderly pressed Close to your breast Kiss me Kiss me Oh, 
Thanks a lot. Fellas, it's always an honor and a kick to be called back to command performance. Before moving on, I'd like to toss off a rapid hello to Lantac, Perez, and Red Cinnery, those three swab jockeys on Navy 116. And to Little Mary, Wild Bill, Trojan Power, Feathers, Arky, and Smitty at 939. And now, friends, here's our third running mate, one of the best-loved girls in the command performance lot. She's going to sing a lively little job called... Deacon Jones, but I'm warning you it's going to sound just a little bit like I couldn't sleep a wink last night. Fellas, Jenny Sims. would break the whole night through. I knew that you'd be sorry, and I'm sorry too. I didn't have my favorite dream, the one in which I hoped I had to call you on. This is Jenny. Eleven and kisses to Ed Mooney, Johnny Hoff, Frank Duvall at 887. And to Curly, Patty, and Smug, those three lonely land girls at Overton Heart. And a speedy recovery to you 30 wounded Tommies at Leeds. And hello to the gang on Corsica. 
Yes, they can. Yeah, Jenny? Well, do we do that corny musical melodrama here, or do the three of us go around once again? <laughs> that little turkey is something we can run in anywhere, Jenny. Besides, I was just talking with Frank Sinatra, and he's been getting a lot of command mail asking for a song called Dancing in the Dark. Oh, that's a swell tune, Ken. <laughs> oh. oh, fellas, here's Frank Sinatra. Dancing in the dark Till the tune ends We're dancing in the dark And it soon ends We're waltzing in the wonder Of why we're here Time hurries by We're here Looking for the light Of a new love To brighten up the night I have you, love And we can face the music Together Thanks again, and I hope Ginny's had time to catch her breath because we're lowering the command performance boom on her again. A beautiful tune in combination with a beautiful gal. In the Still of the Night, sung by Ginny Sims. It's your turn to sing. What a spot. <laughs> okay, fellas, here's Besame Mucho. Yeah. 
Bésame, bésame mucho. Each time I cling to your kiss, I hear music divine. mucho. Love me, my darling, and say that you'll always be mine. This joy is something new, my arms unfolding you. Never knew this thrill before Who ever thought I'd be Holding you close to me Whispering it's you I adore Dear one, if you should leave me Each little dream would take wing in my life Gentlemen of the AEF, we present the Corny Command Theater. Tonight's musical Mellor Dramer is a very tender love story. Ah, very tender. In fact, medium rare. <laughs> it's entitled Frankie and Johnny. I mean, Frankie and Ginny. Ginny will play Ginny, and Frankie will play Frankie. The other woman, the Sirene with lipstick and store bought clothes, is played by Dinah Shore. <laughs> and if you hear a piano, as you so often do in these little bakes, it's our good friend Ticker Freeman. We raise the curtain to present Frankie and Ginny. Oh, Frankie and Jenny were lovers <laughs> Lordy, how they could love They swore to be true to each other Just as true as the stars above Frankie, you're my man But you're doing me wrong don't say that, Jenny. Don't say it. Because I was just about to ask you this. Uh, will you come with me, my dear, to yon beer joint that's so near? <laughs> Where the suds, they are the thickest. Come and have a beer with me. Oh, no, you don't. I know why you want to go down to that awful beer parlor. It's to see that other woman. <laughs> Think I'm not half to you, Frankie, but uh, you never know. Frank, how I suspect you <laughs> of making a play for that dinosaur. Now you're kidding. I know you're kidding. It's just a lot of rubbish and double poo-poo. <laughs> Please, Jenny, uh, don't start suspecting things. Come take a walk now, my dove. Cut, cut, cut right there. That's the end of Act One. Overture. For... <laughs> Frankie and Jenny are walking. Frankie has on a new suit that Jenny bought for a hundred dollars just so her Frankie would look cute. She is her man. What is he doing her wrong? Well, here we are, Jenny baby, out walking, and I'm wearing that new boot you bought me. I wonder what people are saying about my suit. Take it off, take it off. <laughs> quiet, Carpenter, quiet, please. We're doing a play, you know. Say, uh, Jenny, honey, suppose you run along home now and make me a fine soup sandwich, because, <laughs> uh, Jenny, dear, I've got to go now. And I won't be very long. And don't you call up for me, honey. 
Don't worry while I'm gone. Don't you say no more. You're seeing dinosaur. Wish I could. Her husband's an awful big guy. <laughs> no, no. A thousand times no. Now run along, dear, and don't be suspicious. Oh, all right. I'll go. <laughs> Goodbye, Frankie. Goodbye, Goodbye, Jenny. He thinks I'm going home, but I'm not. I'm going to follow him. Will Frankie go to the beer joint? Will Frankie meet Dinosaur? Will Dinosaur meet Frankie? Tune in tomorrow and find out. Oh, oh. no, I must know the answer tonight. So, I'm going down to the corner. Stopping to buy some beer. I'm asking that fat bartender, has my Frankie man been here? Cause he's my man. But I think he's doing me wrong. Oh, ain't gonna tell you no story. Ain't gonna kid you no more. But your Frankie went by just an hour ago with a gal named Dinah Shore. Well, did he go that way? No, he went that way. <laughs> Tall, dark, and famished. <laughs> China, is there anyone finer in the state of Carolina? If there is, and you know her, sure to me, famished. <laughs> Ain't one gal enough for you at one time. You're already two-timing that, Jenny, and what's more two-time, I think you're two-timing me, too. And I'm going to warn you. You know, Frankie, last night I was dreaming and dreamed Jenny shot you. She wouldn't dare do that. Oh, it's illegal. Would. No, she wouldn't. Besides, <laughs> Jenny went home and she doesn't know I'm here. But forget about her, Dinah, because... I love you truly, <laughs> truly, dear. You're murdering me, Frankie. You're murdering me. <laughs> but you're in grave danger. <laughs> you're in grave danger. You think she ain't wise, but I got a tip that uh, Jenny went home in a hurry. She didn't go there for fun. Do you think she went home to get a hold of... That big black shooting gun. I think she did. Uh-uh. Well, I think that you're wrong. Well, Jenny. Oh, I was just passing by and thought I'd drop in. But, but, but Jenny, I, I thought you took a cab and went home. <laughs> That's what you both thought. <laughs> but I got me out on South Clark Street. And through a hole in that door, that door, saw Frankie, my man, a lovin'. That girl named Miss Dinah Shore. Say, if you're my man, you are doing me wrong. Give me a chance. <laughs> you shouldn't say that, Jenny. Because just like I told Dinah, uh, I mean, that is, uh, I love you truly, truly. Dear. And furthermore, sister, what's the big idea of busting in here like this? Put down that gun. It might be empty. <laughs> Jenny, your cause is hopeless. Frankie was your man, but uh, one day he came along. This man you love, not very big or strong. <laughs> This man you love And since he's come my way I'll do my best To make him stay Well, Donna, how could you do this to me While you knew that, uh Thanks, my guy You knew he always was well, That's what I said, didn't I? He was But... My heart tells me that was just a fling. Now your love don't mean 
mean a thing. Why, you know that isn't true. Frankie means everything to me. In fact, she's my everything. Rolled up into one. They rolled them out pretty thin, too, didn't they? <laughs> I guess there's only one way to settle this argument. That's right. We'll ask Frankie to tell us, huh? Uh, yes, sir. Shoot. Which uh, <laughs> which one of us all is you all sweet on, Frankie? Well, gals, I'll tell you. Leave us face it. After getting... <laughs> after you two characters kicking me around like that, <laughs> in the words of our theme song, uh, drive out my rubber-tied carriage. <laughs> drive out my rubber-tied hack. Cause I love a chick in Milwaukee <laughs> And I'm gonna hurry right back I was your man <laughs> But I'm staying so long <laughs> He's ditching the both of us. Hurry, Jenny, get the gun. He's trying to get away. Is he going that way? No, he's going that way. Oh. Frankie sees trouble a coming. Out the back door, he does go. But Jenny takes aim with a pistol, and the gun goes. Where did you? He was a man. But he done a Let's do it again, huh? Well, man, this is Frank Sinatra. Many thanks for the privilege of being here on your big show. So long now for a while. And this is Jenny Fellers. Lots of love. Good luck. Good night to every one of you everywhere. Same here, gang. This is Dana, and we'll see you later. The best of the best from Command Performance, and so long from the USA. And there with the final G2. The command performance is arranged in cooperation with the Hollywood Victory Committee and is produced by the Armed Forces Radio Service.